Hi loves, this is going to be a review on Bella Bella Adele wig, you guys. I purchased it off of LOStyles.com, ElevateStyles.com, um, for about 23 bucks. I'm not sure, you guys. I'll put it in the description box. But I got it in the color 1B. As you see, I'm showing you guys the parting on the wig. Also, I'm going to show you um, that it has one comb at the top there and also it has one at the bottom with adjustable straps and for me the cap construction is just a regular wig cap construction so we're going to get to me putting the wig on As you see from the title, this is going to be another wig review. Hope you guys have been doing wonderful, so we're going to get to the review. So, as you see from the beginning of the video, I just showed you guys um, basically the construction of the cap, which is basically a regular cap construction. Now, the wig review is going to be on a unit called Bella Bella. I think it's Adele. Adele. I mean. Got her in the color 1B, okay, you guys. And the model has on the 430, which I think is kind of pretty. I might actually get that color as well. I purchased the wig off of ElevateStyles.com. Um, I think it was really inexpensive. I'm thinking like maybe 24, because I've been having this wig for at least a month, y'all, for real. Like sitting down for a month, because I was wearing my other wig. So I was like, let me go ahead and pull this one. I start start wearing this one, okay? So we're gonna get to the cap construction now. As you've seen, it has one, um, one comb here. I really don't like cap construction like that. I would prefer my clips on the side. Um, so I did have to add two bobby pins on the side just so that I can feel secure, okay? Now, it's also one in the back. Now, as far as the construction of this cap, y'all, it is not big head friendly. I have a big head, okay? So, it is not a big head friendly um, cap. So, if you have a medium to small head, it may work perfectly, perfectly for you, but if you have a larger head like mine, mm, mm, okay. It does fit, as you see, it's not sliding back or anything, but I mean, it'll be great if it's just a little more room, okay? I did want to get it in a natural color, which is a 1B. Um, just to see, you know, I think 1Bs always look so natural when you get a curly unit. It, actually, any unit. I think 1s and 1Bs look so natural, so I always kind of focus to that color. Especially when I don't know how the unit is going to look on me, and then I may venture out and get a color unit. Um, but yeah, so the party. Now the porting is awesome as you can see. I really like the porting. The only thing it is, it is one of those scaps. Like you can hear. <laughs> it's one of those scap kind of portings. I did put a little foundation this time. I didn't put powder. I decided to go ahead and like get some foundation that was a little bit too light for my complexion. Or you can use your concealer to you know bring out the porting. Um, the hair is very full, very soft, very bouncy, gorgeous curls. Um, yeah, y'all, pretty curls. You see that it bounces right back. I do think it will be. This is one. Of, this is one of those curly units that, if you continue to wear it over and over and over, it just starts to get more gorgeous. Like I feel like it's going to drop because, it because if you look at the. I feel like the curls will drop at the time. If you look at the model, I feel like it's longer on here on her. Um, so this is probably one of those units that you know after a while the curls is just gonna probably end up being like here. It's really long if you pull it, but of course it's gonna bounce back. Okay, you guys did not have to cut this unit. I feel like it perfectly 
tame frame. You know, unless you want to throw it in your face more, I mean, you may have to cut it. But I think it just came perfect. Like, I don't feel like I need to do anything to her. Now, it is one of those units, you keep picking at it, it will get big, so I need to stop because I don't want to get real big. But if you do prefer bigger hair, you can actually pick this hair out and it will get bigger. Um, the top is really flat to me. It's just a nice wig, and I feel like it's an everyday kind of wig. I can just throw it on and go. Um, as far as the fullness, you guys, it really is good. Like, it's a lot of hair, as you can see. So, I would say the length right now on me is maybe a 10. Yeah, I would give it a 10 inch, even in the back. So I give it about a 10 inch, but I think after a while, maybe, I don't know y'all, cause I'm only 5'2", so, yeah, maybe at the time it's gonna drop. I really think it's gonna drop at the time. This wig, you can curl it up to 400 Fahrenheit. Um, it's premium hot temperature fiber, okay? That's what kind of hair it is. So it's safe to curl up to 400 Fahrenheit, but I would never curl especially a curly wig. Like, I don't think I would do that. Now, if it was a straight wig and I wanted to put curls in, then I would try it, okay? So I think that's it, you guys. Everything in a nutshell, this is Adele, and I really like her. I knew I was gonna like her, you guys. I just knew it when I seen it on the website. I love curling units on me. I love it. I think curl units look great on almost like any kind of person. Like, I love it. So, I'll link below where you guys can purchase her. And again, I think her name is Adele. And I hope you guys enjoyed this quick review, okay? Yes, honey, yes. I'm loving it. <laughs> See you guys in the next video. And have a great one, you guys. Bye, loves. Your girl.